Today we are talking all things full and all things Amazon, so I'm so excited to share today's video. Hello guys and welcome to Till Vacuum Do Us Part. If you're new here, my name is Ashley, welcome. I have some amazing fall pieces for you that you can order straight from Amazon and get super fast shipping. I have beauty items, home decor items, fashion, so many pieces I want you to see. So if you're new here, go ahead and click that red subscribe button. Make sure you click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. I post two new videos every single week, but now let's get started. I have this broken down into categories so we're not like all over the place. No promises, sometimes that still happens, but I really wanna start with home decor because I feel like when we think of fall, we think of home decor, we see all these amazing boards like on Pinterest and you think you have to have a ton of money to do it. That is not the case. Also, if you haven't seen my fall decorate video, definitely go check that out after this one. I'll have it linked down below because I even do a lot of like pottery barn DIYs but today we're talking Amazon, so we're gonna stay focused. So let's talk about some of the products I found on there. I picked these up when I was ordering items to decorate my home. So I wanted to do some fall decorating. I wanted to add a little warmth in here. This is our first time decorating for fall in this house. I was leaning towards like that terracotta look. I will say this is a little bit off. It's a little bit darker. It's coming off darker on screen, so it is a little bit lighter in person. Um, but I love this look. And you can also DIY this, like there's tips in my video but I'm still really happy with it like it feels like it pulls some warmth into my kitchen um, and I just felt like this was a really good deal you could leave it just like this if you like this put it in the corner of a kitchen put it um, you know on a shelf somewhere bookcase wherever but I did find some Amazon pieces that will kind of up the ante for fall so let me grab those like I mentioned these vases are perfect by themselves so I'll add a little bit of warmth for fall but I came across Across this set as well and I thought it was funny because it was a set of three just like my set of three vases over here so I thought this may look really good together it's also gonna make it look bigger in a lot of my decorating videos I've been talking about how I'm trying to make pieces look more grand so they look more expensive so I'm trying to combine all those elements here as we're decorating with these um, more budget friendly finds so we're gonna add these to those and see how it turns out This is a very luxe, like high-end look for fall. So if you don't wanna do like bright orange and crazy pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns, you can do a very expensive look from Amazon. Um, and like I said, these all came in sets. You could break this up. Say you don't want these three together or you don't wanna buy a ton of decor. You could space this out. Um, you could give this as a really good like teacher gifts, break them up. You could do three gifts right there. But I feel like this is a very high-end look for fall so if you don't want to have like pumpkins all over your house but you want to get the fall vibe you don't want to spend a ton of money you still want your house to look nice maybe you're having people over this is definitely a good way to do it okay another item that I really think about every time I'm decorating for fall are lanterns and I feel like you can get lanterns in different styles like you can make it farmhouse you can also make it modern um, you can kind of decorate them with different ways you can put candles in them you can do pumpkins depending like if they have glass sides but I've been really into like black thin lines when I was decorating this house we searched high and low for lights that were black but they were like very thin black lines so I came across these lanterns and I loved them plus they've been on sale a lot I bought them on sale I'm hoping when this video goes live they're on sale I'm gonna have everything linked from today's video down below in the description box um, but these alone are just beautiful. Once again, it's a set. You can keep them together. You can separate them. You can put them on your front porch. I have multiple on my front porch. You can put this on a fireplace, shelves, kitchen, bathrooms. They can be used to so many different places. But what's nice, not only do you get these really nice high-end looking lanterns, and they're actually lightweight, which is what's nice, 
they come with the candles. So I feel like that makes it such a better deal. Um, they're the kind you put batteries in and you just flip them on. I will say they don't have a timer, so keep that in mind, but it is the perfect mood in the evenings. Like when you have candles and you don't have to worry about like a kid getting them or a pet, even if you accidentally leave them on, nothing bad's gonna happen, but it just sets the coolest mood, especially for fall with a nice like fall candle. It's just a really good feeling. So let me set these up for you. I'll display them so you can see what they look like, but I feel like these are absolutely beautiful and just look high end without spending a ton of money. I threw them up here on my shelves. If you watched my like fall decorate with me, I have tweaked a few things. And then I just threw up like a YouTube free like screensaver up there just so my TV didn't look super black. I love changing those out. Um, but now that I'm actually using these, like I've been dying to put out all this extra fall home decor, but I wanted to do it live with you guys or semi live, <laughs> like get my real like first impression on here. And it actually sounds like it's crackling. I'll get up close. I don't know if it's supposed to. I do have several candle styles like this where they're made to look real and they like flicker. And it's like it's hitting it. And I think it's made to sound like it's like crackling. And I've had candles like that before. I'm trying to think what they're called. I know someone's probably yelling it at me right now. But um, like woodwick or wood something. But that's what these sound like. So if you like that vibe, um, I feel like it's making that noise. Maybe it's just mine, but I kind of like it. Um, but this is how you could use them. So I love that they like make a statement, but they don't empower. So I had some other black lanterns here. I threw them outside now I might go grab them just to show you they're very thick they're very chunky so for my house they weren't working I love that this is still a lantern and a cozy vibe and you still get the lantern effect but they're not like huge and bulky I'll go grab the other ones just so I can kind of show you the difference just in case if you're in the market and you're shopping and you don't know much about decorating and you don't want to buy the wrong ones because you may like the other style better so I'll show you side by side I'm gonna start off by saying there's no wrong answer here, just so you know that. But here's like a thinner style version and here's a thicker. So both are beautiful, both look nice. If you're wanting a big pop of black, this is the way to go. If you're wanting it to be more subtle, this one, I will use both of these throughout my house, inside, outside. So it's just whenever you're decorating that particular space, figure out what you need, but both are great. I can link something like this too, and I think it has candles and I should have turned them on, but I just wanted to give you that side by side so you can figure out which style you're needing for your home. This next piece I've been wanting to hang out for so long. I even wanted to like take it out of the package, but it was done so well. Like I barely like pulled it open when it came in and I was like, no, I need to show this on camera. Once again, this is just a really good like teacher gift or someone that loves fall and you just wanna like cheer up their day or maybe it's you, maybe you need a little lift me up. Um, I love how this comes. So here's the packaging and you pull it open and it's wrapped, there's a little piece in it. But what's so nice, it says handmade with love. So it's like a wrapped gift that you don't have to wrap. You could just send someone. And then it's a little like, I want to call it a banner or, you know, it goes across your fireplace or across a window. It's like, what is that called? Isn't it a banner? Anyways, here it is. And you can like adjust it out. So if you need it longer, you can pull on these. But I felt like this was a very fun way of like, adding that across the mantle without it being like pumpkins or anything like that. So if you're just wanting that subtleness, um, but the full vibe, this is good. This would be good. This would be pretty in like a nursery or a kid's bedroom. There's so many different places, but I am going to try it on my mantle. I haven't had anything up there yet. Let's see. So it came with little like, oh, hooks. So you can nail them in and this hooks onto it. I'm probably not gonna do that here in my new house yet. I just wanna see if I like it. I can always tape it, but let's go test this out and see how it looks. What a fun way just to bring in a fall. So you can adjust these how you need. Like I have a really long mantle, so I could have pulled it out further, but I kind of wanted it to droop a little bit. I'm just using painter's tape right now. I want to make sure I liked it. I want to make sure it's in the place that I want. And then you can always adjust it, but that is a tip so you don't like mess up your walls or stains or anything. And 
honestly most people wouldn't see you could set something on the painters tape if you have like a wide enough mantle their tv's not above it so you could hide the tape but i feel like this was just cute and fun for fall so if you're needing something like this once again i'll have a link down below now moving on to the next decor item and i promise we're gonna get to like some cleaning stuff some beauty fashion so if you want to see all of that definitely do not click off yet stay tuned um chase has been obsessed <laughs> with these like plush pumpkins every time we go into a store he sees it i have one from last year i keep on the sofa i'm not a big like um like shaped pillow holiday girl but it is nice having it out like you get that fall vibe and it's so cozy so i went ahead and grabbed this one because it was from amazon and it was a good deal it's soft this is a perfect way if you have young kids you can have pumpkins out they can still play with them they could be your coffee table decor they could be on sofas chairs they could just be on the ground by your fireplace it's just such a nice thing to have or if you have pets or anything we're past all those stages here in my house and we still have them out it's just like a cozy vibe um, so if you don't have anything like this yet I think it's kind of like a trending product I don't know if we'll have these out for years to come but they were out last season they're out this season um, and like I said they're just really extra special if you do have kids so you don't have to worry about it getting broke or them getting hurt if it's like heavier glass and they drop it on themselves it's actually actually like a really cool um, like fall piece that your kids can enjoy as well. I went ahead and put it right here with the other one. I think it's just such a fun vibe. So this one I've had out for a few weeks since we decorated. This one can set with it. It's just cute. It's fun. It's something different. You don't have to have it. If you have kids, I highly suggest it over normal pumpkins. Even these same two setting right here would look really good. So if you don't want them on your sofa and you want them to look more like decor, you could put them. I wouldn't put them in a hard bowl. <laughs> I would just set them like on the actual coffee table and I think that would work best. I'm going to go ahead and save like the fall try on haul just for the end. So if you want to see, it's basically sweaters and stuff. So if you want to see those, if you're needing that stay until the end of the video but i want to go quickly i don't have a ton of products for like beauty and like home cleaning and stuff so i can just run through them quickly but i feel like they're must-haves for fall time so the very first fall must-have is kleenexes and i feel like everyone has these in their home but you also need them in your car i have two people that go through kleenexes like crazy i was just never that way like i don't get a runny nose all that often but chase and savannah just constantly have kleenex and so i I love buying these for our car so they're made to fit in the cup holder they have all different designs i thought this one was super fun and all you do is like the tops like perforated so all you have to do is push it in and then you can pull out that little tab and then it's like any other Kleenex and you just pull it out, but it fits in the cup holder. So if you have one in the door or in between the seats or wherever, I just feel like this looks so much nicer. The other thing I like to do is when this is empty, I try to keep it in there with a new one and they can put their trash in it. So this particular set comes in a pack of four. So this is something, you know, it'll last you hopefully through winter or you can share it with a friend or something. Once again, I see stuff like this and I just think it makes the cutest little like gift sets, especially for a teacher. You could put this in with like a hand sanitizer. There's a few things I have out that would make just a cute little winter package or fall package to say, hey, thanks for being my kid's teacher. But even for you, this is something we like to keep in our car fits easy it's not rolling around it doesn't look ugly um it just looks nice and even high end if you're gonna have kleenexes out so like i said there's a different design so i'll link them down below for you next is something i'm very passionate about because during 2020 we all had hand sanitizers everywhere they were hard to find um they dried out my hands i swear like 90 percent of them make me like dry heave i just don't like the way they smell or the way they fill my hand so i finally found a brand that was like moisturizing and then once they sold out they were done like i think they just did it during 2020 and so it became my mission to find a hand sanitizer that smelled nice that worked and that was still like moisturizing it didn't dry out my hands um i also had to find it for my mom because i switched her to my hand sanitizer she works at a bank and she has to use it all the time and so when i told her they stopped making it she panicked just like me but i found the next best thing and i've been using this for a while now 
and I actually bought up, so I have three right now just because we're getting into that like cold and flu season, kids are back in school. Whether we like it or not, we're all gonna be getting sick. I mean, fingers crossed we're not, but I feel like it's just bound to happen. So basically this is the new hand sanitizer that I'm using and I love it. It almost smells like summer, so like it's not a fall scent, I'll say that. It's called um, coconut waters, but it's just the perfect scent, especially like when you're in the car or something, you can really smell it. It doesn't smell like alcohol. It moisturizes your hands i can open this up so you can like see the texture but basically it's as if you put um lotion and hand sanitizer together but you just can't do that on your own because it like dilutes it but if you can see it's kind of like it's not super liquidy um but you just rub it in I wouldn't even call it like it looks kind of like a gel but when you rub it in it feels just like hand sanitizer like a liquid and it smells so good. So, and once it sits for a second and dries out, it smells even better. But if you're needing just a good hand sanitizer, you're over all the other ones. And I get, I have those two just for backups, but I feel like this is so nice to have. It's small, so it just stays in my car door. I always have it buy backups just in case they sell out. I have a few more beauty items, but I feel like I really only have one cleaning. Like I know hand sanitizing, Kleenex. I really don't know if that's like beauty <laughs> cleaning what, but um, we've been cleaning like in our shower and different places. And I kept seeing this tool come up. I feel like it's kind of trending right now. And so I grabbed it. It comes in a set of four. I already have one like that we've been using. This is another great product. It's super affordable. You're gonna be cleaning in the fall. I feel like we're inside more. I typically do more of my deeper cleanings in the fall versus spring. I mean, I always put out spring cleaning videos, but when it's spring, I want to be outside. It's beautiful. So I try to get like the stuff I don't want to do done during fall when we're already inside or winter. Um, but I felt like these were trending. They're super narrow. Do you see that? So they can clean like really cool places like around your toilet or your grout, um, around like faucets. And what I love is a pack of four. So you can either share them. I'm always about sharing. I'm like, buy it, share it, give it away. Or you can have them in different rooms so you don't have to move it around or like if you're just going to clean toilets with it you can mark it with a t so you don't use it anywhere else um, but like i said super affordable they work really well they're like really stiff so they're not going to go out easy and then you'll have backups like i said to either give or use in different spots or just to have when your first one goes out we're going to talk about some beauty products now um i hope this video is not getting so long it feels so long today but i feel like with a fall it's good to change out stuff like our lipsticks maybe our blushes and Another thing is nail polishes. I feel like in the summer, it's so nice to have like neon colors and bright pinks and corals um, like that. But I feel like in the fall, it's really fun to switch to like earthy tone colors. I don't know if you can see this. There we go. So this is just a really pretty brown. I can't put it on my nails. I just got it done. I'm actually gonna do my toes. So don't forget to switch out your toe polish. Um, they have all different colors. You can do earth tones, even pastels work. I feel like really good for summer and like spring and winter. But if you're doing anything and you wanna feel like that really fall vibe or you're going to like a fall um, like kids party or something, I feel like it's just good to like match the theme. And I felt like this was like a really good shade of brown to use. I didn't have this planned for in the video, but I was talking about like changing up your makeup colors. So I just ran and grabbed them and I'll link them down below. I'm pretty sure Amazon has them. But basically I feel like in the summers we wear a little more pinks. They're pink vibes. I feel like in the fall and winter I go more peachy. So you don't have to do this. If you love your makeup, don't change it. But I do go a little more peachy than pink and I've loved this one. I picked this up from Wet n Wild. I also have like a red Aspen one that I really love, but it's not like Amazon, but if you're wanting like a good affordable like peachy blush, I've really been loving this. I've been wearing it for probably three weeks now. And then with my lips, I tend to take that pink away a little bit. I like to take a little bit of pink, like I don't want just brown lips, but this is the one I wore all last fall and you guys always loved it. I will say sometimes I add like a gloss with it or I'll add a little bit of like cream in the center of my lip if you wanna like lighten it up or just add some dimension. But this is on the ground 
Grind 105, but I have a few of these that I like, so I'll link those down below as well as this. So if you haven't tried changing up your makeup, and you don't have to do it a lot, it's mainly your blush and your lips and your foundation. Don't forget if you're like getting lighter, don't forget to start changing out your foundation. But as far as like this color goes, it's just nice. It kind of warms up your skin, especially as your skin gets lighter, the peach warms it up where sometimes I feel like the pink's really harsh, um, like the contrast of it. Definitely try a good um, peach blush and bronzer. These next two products are um, savvy tested loved she loves them anytime i say savannah loves it you guys know it's good she has sensitive skin she's very particular she knows her stuff both of these are hair related products so this one she's been using for a long time and i've probably actually shared it but i wanted to share it again she um uses it all year long but i feel like um some of us may have the problem more in the winter time but it's if you get a dry scalp or flakes um i know a lot of her dancer friends get it just all year long i think it's the like gel and hairspray and all of that um, but they all use this and everyone that has used this has loved it and said it has helped their hair so much so what she does is she just puts this in and lets it sit like all on her scalp or wherever you're having the issue let it set for as long as you can like if you could do you know 10 minutes 30 minutes and then get in the shower if you don't have a ton of time just put it in while you're like doing other things in the shower but if you can let it set for a little bit it probably does help but she has had the best luck as well as her friends friends and this one's like super affordable this next product actually came in our Amazon box for, I think it was like Prime Day and neither one of us had touched it. We just kept like setting it out and I kept thinking I'll try it and then I won't. And then I went to get rid of stuff and she was like, okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and test it out. And she loves it. So it's mainly for like frizzy hair. You put it on while it's wet and then you blow dry it. She said it has helped so much. So once again, I feel like in the fall and winter time, our hair, just everything starts to dry out or at least it does with me. So if you tend to have like, um, you know, drier ends or frizzy hair and you're worried about it getting frizzy, but you have to like wash and dry your hair all the time and you don't want to, and it's not because it's oily, it's just because it's frizzy, definitely go ahead and try this out, add it to your cart and see what you think. But Savannah has really loved using it. Now that it's starting to get drier here, I'll eventually have to test it out. Like my ends get super dry. So I'm really curious, but I promise you if she said she likes it, she does because she's very picky when when it comes to products so anytime she says she loves it i love sharing it with you guys now let's talk about some fashion because i love just ordering stuff from amazon or just online in general i just do not like shopping in stores um but i picked up this piece i'd call it kind of like a oh a dolman sleeve see how like it's a little bit wider here but i love that it just makes them flowy and nice i always buy things in black and then it's hard to show you guys but it is just like a little bit shorter in the front and longer in the back perfect for leggings if you love wearing leggings i feel like i get asked that all the time where do you find all your tunics um for your leggings and it's amazon it's thread up boutiques but like i order all of them and i love it i feel like this is very flattering if you're worried about like your midsection um they had had different colors i just i don't know it's just so forgiving in so many places but you look dressy like i am super comfortable i am all about comfort like i don't have a job where i have to be uncomfortable i refuse to be i want to be comfortable all the time but sometimes you need to look put together <laughs> this is the outfit um i went ahead and threw on these leggings i had picked these up during prime day um, so these are from Amazon as well. I'll link them. They come in a three pack, super affordable, super comfortable, but they have no compression. So if you like something that like sucks you in tight, these aren't them, but these are really good to wear with like tunics because you don't need them to suck you in. You can be comfortable. I love that they're tight all the way down. I don't like when anything's loose around my ankle and they're tight. And I love that they don't have pockets. So a lot of people say these are dupe for like the align lulu leggings what i love is that they don't look athletic unless you want them to like i have some with pockets that i can only wear with like tennis shoes and workout outfits these can definitely go both ways i can dress them up because there's no pockets there's no lines there's like a seam right here but you don't really see it um so like i said you can dress them up for this but if i want to put them on to work out or anything to me if i'm going to work out i want like the I don't know, I just want them tighter when I'm to suck in, but I feel like they're perfect just for like outfits. I feel like they're, 
I have dressier leggings that are like faux leather, but I feel like this is something in between, but I look, they look super nice, very forgiving, like smoothing, I feel like, without being like super uncomfortable. This is the next top I threw on. I will say I have it in black too. I'll throw it on just so you can see it, but I knew you would be able to see more of the details like in this coloring. The black is just a solid black, but I love this stripe. I love that it doesn't start until right here. There's just something super flattering about it. Once again, I feel like this is legging um, friendly as long as it just covers up enough back there. I don't want to like wear anything short, especially with leggings like this that are just super tight. Um, but I feel like I could wear this out so so comfortable i just throw it on with a wedge but you could wear this with like a sneaker or anything you want to um i feel like it looks high-end like it looks like a you know express or black and white store something like that and when i tell you the quality is amazing like this is super super nice high quality it's gonna last you several falls and winters like i said for fall it's perfect you can throw a jacket over it for winter love 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 this design i hadn't tried this on yet so now that I have I'm gonna have to order just a few more in them especially before I share this because you guys are gonna sell it out but it's amazing I'm gonna pop up my size here on the screen because I'm pretty sure it's a medium but if it's anything different I'll pop it up just so you guys know for like size reference it is a medium I just checked here it is in black I'm a solid black girl all the way. Here's the sleeves. I love that you can kind of push them up and it like gives you a little bit, just like not a bubble sleeve, but it just gives you a little bit of texture right here. Um, I'm not going to lie. I almost like the other color better, even though like I love all black. I feel like this would look really good with like denim, like jeans and something else. Like, I mean, I'd still totally wear it this way, but if you wanted to break it up, putting it on with like a denim jean would look really good too. Once again, it is so cozy it feels so nice like definitely definitely high quality I also wanted some good like oversized crew necks <laughs> um, for fall this is like my go-to look like if I could live in this and go everywhere in this if summer would allow this I would totally do it this is totally my vibe I have not been wearing these leggings all that much I mean it's part due because it's been so hot outside, but I actually loved them more than like when I originally tried them on. I didn't know if I was a fan, but they are going so well with everything. Like this is a more comfy look and it looks good. I think I like that they're just like fitted. Like, you know, they're not loose anywhere, but they're not tight at all. They're kind of like a butter legging. Um, and they're also very like, if you're long legged, they would work. I'm not, I pulled them up so they'd hit me at my ankle, but then it like disappears, like all the wrinkles <laughs> went away. So like, I don't know, they're magical leggings. So definitely check those out. Like I said, they're a three pack and I'm like in love now. And they're like a lighter weight. So you don't have to worry about getting super hot, especially in the fall if it's not like cold yet. But here is the crew net that I'm supposed to be talking about. <laughs> it's a size medium. It's a perfect length. I mean, if you wanted to size up to go cozier, you could, but I feel like it's already very oversized. And then I just want to throw these on because I love these slippers. Um, they are so comfortable. They're made to give you support here. They're, they're cushiony, but they still look cute. And I feel like these are perfect perfect because if I like do too much of a closed toe my feet get so hot and I get hot so this is like the perfect balance and they have other colors so I'll link that too but that is it if you guys like seeing fashion during my Amazon videos definitely comment down below because I can do more like try-ons for you um during the Amazon video I'm gonna go ahead and leave this outfit on because it's so cozy and I'm just gonna be hanging out here editing today but thank you guys so much for watching today's video I hope you liked it I hope you loved the fall theme um if you want any other themed style Amazon videos definitely let me know down below um in the comments section and don't forget in the description box I have all these items linked for you and they come in all different sizes and all different colors I just kind of gravitate towards neutrals and if you're new here and you enjoyed the video and you haven't hit that subscribe button yet definitely do it I post two new videos every single week and I'd love to have you here I hope you guys have a wonderful week and I will see you in the next one bye